Hello, you're a cheater. <laughs> How are you? Good morning. We're doing the parcel saga. We are. I'm loving it. We we had 23 parcels in the hallway. Now, they're not just from Amazon. They're not. They are from other places as well. But as Mr. P not what? what? Why are you smoking like that? Most of them are from Amazon. But there is a few dotted in between from different places. I'm sure there is. I hope you are. So, so far, we've got some goodies for my birds. A gold nighty. And what's next? What's next? What's next? What's next? Ta-da! Ta-da-ding! Ta Don't hurt your wrist if you pick any of the heavy ones up. That doesn't look heavy. Is that heavy? It's not heavy. <laughs> oh god, it really isn't heavy. What's in it? There is something in it. But what? It's from Amazon, so thanks Bill. I'm loving it. I am loving Basil Saga. Parcel ta saga takes on a whole different meaning when it's from Amazon. When we did the old parcel sagas, it was all from eBay and it was all Chloe, wasn't it? In the very early days. We started off as parcel saga in the very early days. Hmm? Got my what? What are you saying? I was lazy. Why? Oh, I'm in bed now, as in last time I would walk in with the other parcels I'll go. Can't really do much walking in these 90s. <laughs> I got no knickers on. <laughs> what is in this? Well, okay. I think they've got a bit overkill on the box. Because, where is it? <laughs> <laughs> it's another bird feeding thing but come on did they need that bigger box to fit it in look at that do you want to see what it is i saw it and i was like yeah i need to get this for the birds so it's something different i've been looking for different ways to feed my birds and amazon's the way to go So what you do is you put the balls on. You know the feeder balls, you put the balls on there. Instead of them being in a cage, the balls, you put them on there. That's cute. Look, oh, it looks like a parrot. Watch it, the nose, the beak. The beak looks weird. But yeah, I just thought it was something different. But, got him? Yeah, hangs there. So that hangs on your bird feeder like that. And then you could put one, two, three, four balls on. So that's good, isn't it? Something different. And they're by a company called Trixie. Now they are German. I seem to be finding all the German companies for it. So they're fat ball feeders. I think that's the picture. Yes. Trixie! I don't like the beak. The beak looks weird. Yeah, looks a bit bent, the beak. But I think it's pretty cool. I think, oh, that I have on my phone next to me, I don't know. I think it was seven pound. But it is metal. So it is sturdy. And it's not too sharp on the end. So I don't think the birds will hurt themselves with it. Which is good because I, I don't want the birds to hurt themselves. But it, I just thought it was quirky. I think the box is a bit overkill. It could have gone in a flat box. That could have gone in one of those flat envelopes. Would it have got bent with it? Not complaining. I've got a big box again. But that that's pretty cool. Except for the beak. Okay, can we change the beak? Can we chop a bit off the end of the beak? <laughs> the beak. <laughs> Paint it. I don't think I've got anything that would go on metal. No. No, not black metal anyway. It wouldn't show up. Plus it might scare the birds off if it looks like a real bird. Kind of. We'll try it out anyway. 
when we feed the birds. Oh no, I've got a choice. Oh no. Because we when we feed the birds, we always take one new item down as to not freak them out with so many new items. They don't like that donut. They don't like the donut feeder. I'm a bit good that they don't like the donut feeder. Yeah. But they don't. But we'll leave it up, see how it goes. But hopefully they'll like this and they'll like the acorn. I know they'll like that because I'll just put a suit of black in it. They'll not know any different for that one. But yeah, my Trixie Bat Ball Feeder. Don't forget, guys, I'm asking a little favour at the moment. What I'm asking you to do, because my views are not accurate and my likes are not accurate on my videos, what I'm asking you all to do is put me a thumbs up, a yellow Simpsons coloured thumbs up in the comments below. Yes. Obviously like the video as well because then I can see the difference because it's not accurate If I only have two likes of there, but 50 thumbs up down below It shows how inaccurate it is So if you can like the video for me still and put a thumbs up down the bottom, that would be amazing of you Obviously give me a subscribe Subscribers make me happy because it means you are enjoying my videos and want to watch them again Click on all your notifications as well and then Come back in a couple of weeks and make sure you're still subscribed with your notifications switched on because YouTube are unsubscribing my subscribers. I love saying it like that. I don't know why. I just love saying it like that. I do. Then I'm on my social media. Twitter and Instagram is at Adarsex UK. Facebook is at official Adarsex UK. And then, of course, we have my OnlyFans. Now, I'm not sponsored, endorsed or monetized on any of my platforms on YouTube, but on my OnlyFans, I am. Yes. So we have the freebie one where there's videos uploaded. We have the $10 one, which is my past three years of Patreon videos. So there's voyeurism, showers, changing rooms, changing clothes, all sorts on there. Then we have the naughty one, which are all the brand new voyeurism ones, but also the triple X ones. So if you want to go and check out my only fans, the links are all on my Twitter, which is at Adelsex UK. And me and my Trixie fat ball feeder, we'll see you later.